In this video, I'm gonna give you a blitz that is absolutely gonna start screaming at your opponent some pressure in this game. What's going on guys, my name is Cody and I wanna thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is focusing on helping people become the best Madden players they can possibly become. So if you're looking to get better at this game, I just wanna encourage you to hit that subscribe button down below. It's completely free to subscribe to the channel and it just allows you to stay up to date with the latest tips and strategies that we release here on the channel. All right, guys, so we're talking about the 335 odd out of the, I think that I'm in the New York Giants playbook. You can also do this out of several other playbooks. But what you want to do is you want to turn auto flip off. It's really important to turn auto flip off. You can do that in your coaching settings or in your game options uh, in the game. So just turn auto flip on. And so as you can see here, I can flip the play wherever I want. What we want to do is we want to come out in this place stock. Now, before we go any further, I do want to let you know about my text message membership. If you've not signed up for the text message membership, it's completely free to sign up for that. All you have to do is text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. And it's the best way to get updated about my newest offenses or my newest defenses. We also release free offensive and defensive guides to our text message members throughout the season. So be sure to stay on the lookout for content coming to that membership. Again, all you have to do to sign up for it is text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. So we're gonna come out in LB Cross Show too. And what we're gonna do is we're going to uh, flip this play, we're gonna press, and then we're gonna spread our defensive line. So what you're gonna see is you're gonna get this look right here. You might have to wait a little bit. For some reason in practice mode, sometimes my adjustments don't register. So just hang with me, there we go. Um, so they register right there. So as you can see, we're gonna get this look, okay? Now when you get this look, all you're going to do is you're going to sit here with your user. And what I like to do is I like to crash my line down just like this right here. And that's pretty much the adjustment. And what I like about this way of running this defense is it's gonna give me a little bit better of a position to user this middle linebacker. So what you're gonna see is I'm gonna kind of stand right in here and then I'm just gonna run down and you're gonna see the pressure is gonna absolutely scream right off that left side edge. Now the beauty of this is actually found in the fact that we can user on this opposite side backer and you're going to see here again i'm just going to kind of set the set the set the tone here with the pressure but what's also really cool um, is let's say for example that i'm trying to stop the run this is a really good run defense because you're going to see here halfback base really doesn't stand a chance as you can see we can easily blow the base run up for you know a really short little game what I like about what this does is it doesn't only give us really good run defense, especially for shotgun running plays, but what it also does is it gives us an amoeba look. And what I mean by that is this linebacker here on the outside, if I were to take this, let's say for example, I was to take um, the X receiver. So I'm just gonna kind of stand and kind of pivot a little bit more to the right side. And I'm gonna take that X, um, that defensive end on the right and put him into a quarterback spy. Okay, and what you're gonna see here is it's gonna allow us to get basically looping pressure right through the A-gap as long as I get a good user. And as you can see, we're coming unabated to the quarterback. Let me show you that one more time. So again, just flip the, flip the defense. You see you get these two guys stacked over the A-gap. And then you're just going to um, basically spread your defensive line. You see this guy's gonna walk back down just like we want him to. We're gonna spread our line or we're gonna crash our line down. And then we're just gonna user that guy uh, into a zone and what you're gonna see here is at the snap of the ball You're gonna see that this little bum rush right here is gonna create a crazy fast little edge rush Sometimes this rush will get picked up. It typically depends in my opinion on kind of where your user kind of lands um, What I like to do and what I haven't been doing is I I'd normally like to contain rush um, And the reason why is because I want this guy to take a really wide blitz angle and if you stand kind of here and then basically just run to the left, you're gonna see just run to the left just like that, you're gonna see that pressure continually or consistently come in off that left side. One other little pro tip of things that you can do with this, and this is um, something I wouldn't actually normally advise people to do, but I do like to do this out of the three through five odd. And that is what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this guy white and you're going to man him up onto the running back. The reason we're gonna do that is you're gonna see here um, the post snap movement of this little of this linebacker as far as your lurk. You're just gonna run down and to the left and you're gonna see the pressure is gonna absolutely scream right off that left edge. What this also allows us to do um, is for example, let's say for example, the, uh, the opponent, uh, let's say for example, that your opponent you know is blocking a running back whatever it allows us to go ahead and basically if they block the running back 
you're gonna see here still, if we basically just send that slot corner and we still run that guy down, you're gonna see that we're gonna get really good edge heat still off that right edge. So you've got kind of, you kill kind of two birds with one stone and that's why I like um, that adjustment. Now, again, just remember, spread the line, crash your line down, and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna kind of hold right in this little pocket right here. And the reason I like this, um, the reason I like this so much is because it really does force um, you know your user you see you get this nice clean angle for that rush off the edge so anyways 335 odd is loaded this year with a lot of different types of pressures and, and concepts it's got great run defense from shotgun this year so it's a really good shotgun formation in my opinion as you saw i showed how to stop the shotgun run uh, from the 335 odd with that defense so so far so good with this defense at least at this point in the season i would encourage you to check out the 335 odd i know a lot of the pro players have been running something some version of this blitz not exactly this blitz but different concepts like that so anyways thanks for watching the video and if you want to learn or be updated uh, about more men 22 content i want to encourage you to join my true fan membership what my true fan membership is is it's basically a brain dump it's a place where i um i basically give exclusive access to a discord we're going to be launching our discord um for the year as soon as madden 22 officially launches and it's a place where basically we go really in depth in the game we break down the latest and hottest defenses of the week we break down the hottest offenses every single week we also break down kind of the meta on both sides of the ball as well as what the pro players on the mcs circuit are doing we take a look at actual game tape and literally break down step by step what the best players in the world are doing on both sides of the ball so if you want to get access to that exclusive content we post 12 videos a month over there as well as we've launched our discord we're going to be launching that discord here in a few days go ahead and join the true fan membership it's just five bucks a month super cheap for what you get and you can join that at the description in this video again it's just five bucks and you can join it at the description uh, i put a link to the patreon in the description of the video